I'm actually curious how much you relate to each other's characters. When have you been the awkward guy and when have you been the sort of cool and control guy ever? Well, Louis. Right now, let's, uh, I think it's happening let's that I'm honest. the cool guy. Lewis. Kevin is incredibly awkward in the way he's handling this I don't think we need to be honest here. here. I don't think I've ever been the awkward <laughs> guy. I think uh, I'm a guy who's kind of embraced cool all my life. Now, guys like Josh. What did you just pull up? I me? stopped my phone from ringing, Josh. What? Because I'm cool, I get calls. No, that's not cool. Josh's phone Shit. hasn't rung the, since we've been here all That's the cool thing to do is to shut your phone off. Oh, your phone's off? To not be like, is your phone oh, off? I'm in an interview. Oh, hey. oh I'm Josh Gad. No one calls me. I cry sometimes at night. What? <laughs> that's not true. Yeah, that's Josh. I don't yeah. want people calling me hey, at night. I'm hey, sleeping. What's your cell? What's your cell service provider? Mine's is no friends. <laughs> <laughs> he won that. Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, okay, no, I associate you both with like really awesome live performances. You and Book of Mormon. You and stand up. Who's the you. most awesome? I guess celebrity you saw in the audience that you didn't know was going to be there. Oprah Winfrey, for sure. Oprah. Oh my God! What do you do when you see Oprah in the Jeez. audience? Uh, actually, oh, no. tie between Oprah and Barbara Streisand because I, you do you sort of like freeze when you first walk out, especially in the Book of Mormon theater. Eugene O'Neill, you can see everybody in the audience pretty much. So you would walk out there, and every day there was another crazy A-lister. But for me, seeing those two was just kind of like one step above. So with Barbara Streisand in particular, I think there were like two or three times where I just kind of fell apart and sort of forgot my lines because I was like, uh, sh this legend is out I there. I did that with uh, Dudley from Different Strokes. Right. <laughs> you guys familiar with him? Yeah, I certainly. I saw him in one of my shows and I said, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> said, you know, that's Dudley. Yeah. So. I thought you were going to say Barbara, too. That would no. have been awesome. Barbara Streisand goes. Actually, you know, I, I honestly know what he's talking about because I met Barbara Streisand before, and it was the same thing. There's certain people, and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not that guy. I don't do that. But there's certain she's people who just like, accomplished yeah. so much Oprah in their too. career. She has like that. Oprah came to my house, shut my house down. No. Oprah, was, she interviewed me at my house. Hey, uh, Kevin, we, uh, nobody in or out the house. Phone lines got to go off. Um, also, my security needs to just go around. The nobody can come in or out my house. I became a prisoner in my own house. I asked, can I go to the bathroom in my house? Hey, brother, you mind if I go use my bathroom real quick? Make it quick. <laughs> Jeez, sorry, buddy. For the latest from HitBix, visit HitBix.com or download the new HitBix app on your Roku device.